When we decided to do a renovation on our house, we thought this would make a perfect laundry room because it was actually our second floor kitchen and it already had the plumbing. So that's amazing. It also had venting which for the stove, which we could use for the dryer. And so this is our original kitchen sink, original countertops. We've repurposed the cabinetry. And for example, this was our pantry and which had our food items in it before, but now it has become closet space. We didn't feel good about throwing it in the garbage. So, you know, we've repurposed it and thought that was a little bit more of an environmental choice. And so the washer and dryer, this used to be the fridge and we've put that there, which is lovely. And this was where the dishwasher was and it is now towel storage with these great sliding drawers. And it's obviously, it's great to have somewhere to fold your laundry. So we brought up our stainless steel folding table and hampers from the basement, which just happened to fit perfectly. So that was very pleasing. And we've installed a couple of Ikea drying racks, which are great because they fold down and don't take up space all the time. This room has actually also become a walk-in closet for us because we had a fair amount of square footage. So we were able to do that. It's um, become this wonderful multi-function, multi-purpose space where we can just sort of do everything all at once. The laundry gets folded on the table, put away in the various closets. It's become a great addition to the house. I love the fact that their space has been planned so well, so that it doesn't matter how big or small it is, everything has a purpose, everything, everything has a purpose. is functioning the way it should. So we want to talk a little bit about having uh, double duty furniture. So if you have a small space, and so many of us in this country are living in condos or teeny tiny little homes, yeah. you have to make the best use of your space. And you've, have you heard of micro condos? This is a new thing that's yes. actually hitting Toronto especially, but it's tiny, yeah, tiny little spaces so that every single piece of furniture has more than one purpose. So we brought right. a couple items here today, kind of working that same way. But what I really like, something you mentioned, everything has a purpose, so you have to be really thoughtful right. about what you're bringing into your home. We accumulated a lot of our furniture, you know, as hand-me-downs, you know, when we were first married, and then you sort of accumulate things as you go. So to your point now, yeah, it's a great time to really take a look around, see what really works in your home, mm -hmm. and then look for other things that maybe you can introduce that can kind of do more than one thing. Right. Let me give you an example. So this looks like just a typical tray. Yes. But actually, it it's also a is bed. a bed. <laughs> Just joking. Oh my god, that would be amazing. Can you imagine? <laughs> Not quite. But it is now a breakfast tray. I was actually saying this is perfect for, um, not that I want to work in bed, but you could have this <laughs> laptop in bed it's on a okay. Saturday morning and drink your coffee and do a little bit of emailing and things. That's beautiful. But That's a gorgeous tray. You know, interior designer's best friend is trays. I found this one uh, is another one that it, it just seems to work. It looks beautiful, but yes. it actually works so you can put drinks on it. Yeah. Right? You can actually move it from one room to another. So uh, really, again, just being thoughtful about what you're bringing into your home. Double let's, duty. Let's okay, talk what about double the ottoman? ottoman? So of course, double duty ottoman means it's a dishwasher. <laughs> okay, no. I am gonna okay, so sorry. I'm not gonna do it again. <laughs> so what, what you have though is you have extra storage, right? right? Which I think is all important when the kids are playing in the living room and That's people are coming say. over. Right? Throw, Throw it, in it in there. And nobody sees it. Like 13 Barbies. It's like a magic trick. That's right. It's like gone. Oh, look at my space. It's perfect. My house is perfect. Yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> speaking of perfect houses, love this couch. Of course. Of course it's a bed. It really, it's you know, it's the easiest okay. thing in the world. Pull yeah. it, I could do it, but then I would have to rearrange all the furniture, but one-handed, pull it out, and now you have an extra place for somebody to sleep. Very or your nice. kids when they're having a sleepover, whatever. For so, sure, and these have become so much easier, I find. The sofa beds, it used to be oh like, gosh, oh remember? my God, let's get uh, five people in yeah. to get this thing out, yeah. and the cushions were heavy. Yeah. Now it's very easy so to do. So sleek, that. so easy, goes into anybody's home. Uh, it can look great, obviously, add your own throw cushions. Meant to mention that EQ3 is a company that helped us out with a lot of this stuff. They're good And I know you'll have it on the website as well. So Absolutely. Nelson. Bench. This is a very um, famous piece of furniture. Actually, it uh, was introduced in 1946. Mm -hmm. And the whole philosophy behind it is it's seating or it's a coffee table. Oh, I can sit on that. You can sit on it. You can. You absolutely That's can. That's not going to break. I promise. I'm going to do it. Okay. <laughs> okay. I'm ready. You're going to sit on it. Okay. Oh, yes, it's sturdy. Okay. So, again, think of Adam Hardy. If you want to have your couch space, yeah. you move the bench over. You can have your trays on top with the food and drinks. It really is, you know, it's very thoughtful. And that's the whole philosophy behind it's it. It's beautiful, dual too. Purpose. Yeah. I love the design Right of it. behind you, too. Again, something that yeah. looks sort of decorative. It's, it's a side table. 
you could take the but plants off. But it's also a stool. You can sit on it. Yeah, exactly. that's smart. And we're just thinking about having people over, entertaining. How can you use these items? Obviously, a nice basket. Another one of those, ta-da, and yeah. all your clutter disappears because you just throw it inside. Very nice. So you can throw the cushions in here if you want to switch them out. You can throw the Barbies in here, whatever. It's great. Or you can use this as a laundry basket. Well, it looks like a laundry basket Wouldn't to that me. be nice? Well, and also, we just saw the video of the perfect laundry room, which I'm so jealous of. So am I. Yeah. Yeah, my laundry room does not look like that. Okay, gorgeous. I love this. Good. We've, we've got, let's sit on the bench with me. Okay. Let's be bold. All right. Well, well I'm going to go Autumn on. Just, just like, okay, fine. Yeah. Let's go to break. More coming out. <laughs> it's holding me out.